folks, Chris Voss here from the ChrisVossShow.com, the ChrisVossShow.com. Today here we're going to share with you a really cool speaker system for your iOS devices from iHome. That's iHome. We reviewed a number of their products and we've always loved them on the ChrisVossShow.com. And you can find them at iHomeAudio.com. That's iHomeAudio.com. Now this is their ID-55 portable speaker system. And as you can see here, you can use it to play your iPad, your iPhone, and your iPod. And what's also great is it takes and charges it for you. It will also utilize the app that iHome has on the App Store that uh, you can use for your alarm clocks and different things like that nature uh, that will uh, take and play through the speakers. So you can see here it's got a couple different functions that are really nice. Um, and you can actually take this traveling, because it has batteries, and a plug. So, you can have it open or you can have it closed. You can see your two different positions. We'll get into this here in a second. Let's go and rotate this around so you can see some of the outsides of the box before we fully unbox this. <clears throat> now, it has SRS True Bass, which is a digital sound processing for dynamic audio performance. It's got Resin 8, which is a full range stereo speakers featuring Resin 8 chambers for detailed dynamic sound. It's got a universal dock that charges and plays the iPhone, iPad, and docking uh, iPod modules. And it has a sliding cover for protection and portability and a lining jack for other audio devices. So you can use this as speakers for a myriad of different devices. And it's got a really cool slide over protective cover. So we're gonna go ahead and open this baby up and see what's inside, shall we? Okay, so as you can see here, this actually won from iLounge.com. They do a lot of reviews. The Best of Show 2012 finalists. So this won some awards in uh, the quality of what people thought of it. And, uh, wow, designed and engineered in the USA. That's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and pull open the box and see what we have inside here. Like I said, we reviewed a number of the iHome products. Be sure to search for those on the ChrisVossShow.com. You can just type in iHome and people will see some other thing. And our plugin should pull up related posts also. So if you're watching this, you can probably find those in the related posts. Looks like we've got some user manuals, warranties, all that sort of good stuff. Maybe a sticker or something. We'll open up here in a second and see. Looks like we've got your box of cables, most likely, here. Let's take a look. And yep, we sure do. We've got a big old power uh, plug. And then, of course, the cables to take and plug into there. Looks like we've got the unit itself. Now this is a good size unit for a speaker, but uh, it's easily heftable and actually feels pretty good to carry this way. And so that's really important because this is not only um, this is not only something you, you can plug into your home, but it's also portable. Wow, and it's got a really nice fascia across the front of it. As you can see here, it looks like we've got some advertisement stuff. We'll slide that advertisement stuff out of there. So yeah, it's got a really beautiful feel to it. You can see here kind of a, a faux grain of leather, uh, pretend leather if you will. It's hard plastic. It just gives that look. But definitely feels comfortable to carry around. I can feel that already in being able to hold it. Uh, ergonomically it fits really well to the hand. Let's take a look at what we have here. So we've got just the side there. Along the back looks like we have an area for line in for auxiliary so you can plug your speaker systems into this and we have the uh, power DC line in uh, button for powering the device if you're not running off the batteries looks like up front we have iHome and it looks like this thing just very easily slides backward very simple and easy you just give it a pull and there it comes now it looks like we have a pop-up that comes up when it's open which is something that your iPad can rest on or your iPhone or your iPod namely most likely the iPad because it's so huge it puts a lot of different weights you can see here we have the charger plug and the connector of course and we have a power uh, area we have volume up and down buttons and that's pretty much it it does look really good looking when you have it open and then of course when you have it closed, you can take it with you. Easily be able to throw this into a backpack, etc., etc. Let's take a look at what's on the bottom. We've got some your regulatory stuff here. And it looks like we just pop this. And we have an area for batteries. So we can put the batteries in there and all that good stuff. Now we have some nice rubber grommeted bottoms here so that we can take and put this on a nice end table, if you will. 
coffee table, whatever the case may be you want to use this for, but it may be an end table by your bed and it's not going to scratch the surface. So we have that as a utility that we can take and do. Okay, so we've gone and put our iPad on here. It's very easy to do. We plugged, of course, the device in. Uh, very easy to slide this onto the device, and you can hear it click there saying that it's connected. Let's go ahead and turn on the power. And we've got this turned pretty much all the way up so you can kind of hear how this sounds. This is uh, royalty free music from uh, Rock on Chicago, Kevin McLeod. We'll go ahead and hear this thing playing, and you can get an idea as to the sound of the music. Let's, there we go. So it fills the room very nicely. It's got a great sound to it, ambient sound with both highs and lows. From all the different other music we played through that's commercially driven, uh, it sounds really, really good. It fills the room very nicely. It's great in the kitchen too where we are doing this recording. So uh, it, in the kitchen it tends to give you a nice, full, beautiful sound. You can easily adjust the uh, volume up and down as you also can on your ILS device, which makes it very nice. Now. The one other thing I told you is uh, there is an app that you can download called the uh, iHome app. Just look for it on the uh, App Store. You should be able to find it. And you'll be able to utilize this uh, alarm system clock thing that you can build. You can set wake up times. It'll show you, of course, your weather and different things. You can go into the settings and adjust the settings uh, for where you are, uh, general wake up, wake volume background, reminders, overnight news, etc, etc, all that sort of stuff that you can take and program in here. So very cool and what it'll do is it'll play of course through this thing. So it's a great thing to be able to utilize if you want to set this beside your bedside, you want to have a nice wake up alarm that plays some wonderful music for you. But the great thing is you can see here that this is charging the iPad here during this whole time that we're utilizing it. So very awesome that way and it's a great good looking device as you can see here. Let's kind of spin this a little bit you can see the iPad sitting in it so it does look great and the other great thing is is that when you want to take this maybe maybe you want to go to school with this you're a student you want to wrap this up all you got to do is unplug it you've got your batteries in there bada bing bada boom throw it in your backpack and you can take this traveling throw it in your car or duffel bag you can take this to the beach with you or what other fun stuff you want to take and do so it really is amazingly uh, transportable and portable and then of course when it's set up it looks very nice in its design and build and how it uh, <clears throat> how it sits up for you so it's the iHome ID 55 one thing I did want to show you is um, the bag that had the owner's manual stuff in it we were wondering what was in there so let's get back to that looks like there's a little brochure here that shows all the different cool pictures of the different products from iHome. We've actually tested out this product, the IP4. You can find that reviewed on the ChrisVossShow.com. A beautiful boom box and different, definitely well sounding. You can see some of the other products. They make a plethora of awesome products on the website. Go see them. Looks like some warning systems and then also some safety guide instructions, owner's manual, all that good stuff. So be sure to check it out. You can go to iHomeAudio.com. That's iHome audio.com and you can order one for yourself tell them Chris Voss sent you Chris Voss tested Chris Voss approved definitely like it thanks for coming by be sure to search for the other iHome products on the Chris Voss show.com and be sure to see us soon